Now, travel around Korea is expected to undergo a transformation from next year as aviation companies are set to begin operating small passenger jets in regional areas. The new air taxis will significantly reduce often long travel times. EG1 has more. This is a small regional jet that can sit 50 passengers. With a speed of 900 kilometers per hour, it will reduce what was a six-hour express bus journey between Yangyang County and Kime City to less than an hour. A one-way ticket will cost about 77 U.S. dollars, approximately twice the bus fare. The company introducing the service will begin operations from as early as next year. It also plans expanding its operations to Jeju Island in time for the 2018 Pyeongchang Olympics. With a speed this fast, it will only take 30 minutes to get anywhere in South Korea, and 50 seats are just right for the Korean market. Other companies are also jumping into the market. In May, another small air transportation company bought these jets to operate from Ulsan Metropolitan City and Pohang City to Kimpo City. The government is also looking to introduce a similar service for Ulungdo Island and Huksando Island within the next five to six years. This would turn a five- to nine-hour trip involving trains, buses and boats to a quick one-hour plane ride. The government plans to build a short 1,200-meter runway on each island. The plan is to minimize difficulties in traveling to and from these islands for both residents and tourists and hopefully boost the domestic economy. Also, it will be of great use in monitoring illegal fishing vessels and rescue actions. The government says it will seek residents' opinions on the project and will work to minimize environmental damage. Lee Ji-won, Arirang News.